guys, he left me. He left me. Well, just going for study. Coming back. Where are you? Trapped in the house. Hey. August did not slip away in a moment in time and August was actually mine. Let's talk about it. So the month starts off with a really impromptu trip to Lahore. I did not plan this but a couple of work things came up. I had the money and I was seriously down in the dumps especially after July. So I put my two cents together, packed my bags, all my cameras and went to Lahore. A lot of that trip was food related. So I'm going to hand it over to Pas Tuba to take you through that trip. Hello and good morning from a wonderful Lahore. We're going to Johnny and Jugnu and I'm excited because everyone in Lahore talks about Johnny and Jugnu and I don't know what the hype is so we're going to go see what the hype is. It's time to get Jugnu. We have now Chinese chips, which is wok, which are wok tossed fries. We got some honey garlic wings. Ooh, garlicky. And then I got some chili chicken fries. Ch smell interesting. So they really just took Chinese food. and fries and toss them together. I don't know what I was expecting. It wasn't this. It's like a six. The chicken wings, they seem really soft. I don't like a soft wing, so I don't think I would like this. Pretty mad. I'd give the fries a six <laughs> and the wings a five. <laughs> really mad. Really sad. Hello, I'm skipping towards a sweet thing as well. No, tell me the juicy story. What's going on? Don't skip over the cute stuff. Cracks my face too, so I like to move and move with me. It's so cool. Look, see the camera's moving. This is perfect for you. I know. Pull, 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 pull to the pull. We're 
we're at this place and it's so fancy. It's crazy. How did you get it? It's very sweet. Dadu Mazu Ayo. Dadu Mazu Ayo. Dadu Mazu Ayo. D-Maxine. This is Cuban food. Oh, Cuban food? Yeah. It's pretty random. It's so random. It's so random. It's so random. Yeah, yeah, like pink food. Yeah. How many servings is one thing? Noodles with beef. Okay. Beef noodles. Beef noodles. And dumplings. Vibes. No braised beef? We can do the braised beef also. That looks pretty braised. It looks very braised. Let's try it next time. Let's try it next time. Our food looks good. It's a market. It's like we haven't eaten yet. It's very Chinese. It used to be good at doing. Everybody wants to come to us. Okay. You got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Clean sweep, nice. Let's ask for the bill five times. Let's ask for the bill five times. Because their service is so bad. Standing in that kitchen, you should be paid like hundred dollars per second to stand in that kitchen it's not good that you got complimentary dessert it's going okay as soon as i came back from lahore i was back on the bakery grind i come back and there's a lot of work waiting for me Good morning. Let's get to work. A couple of bulk orders to do. I had a couple of big cakes to do. So it was one of those things where I was working non-stop. <gasps> Done. <laughs> no one won't believe that I had nothing ready for this order. Literally, maybe like two hours ago, I made the dough all over again. I made the ganache. I made the <laughs> pastry cream. I made the jam. I folded it all together. Like It was the most stressful two hours of my life. Then the last week of August was filled with a lot of really painful goodbyes. My best friend, my food partner, my fiance got into one of his dream programs in Australia and I'm so happy and so proud of him. Like I'm so proud of you Ozzy. He really has been a rock for me these past couple of years and especially this past year I have to say goodbye to him as you can imagine emotions were really high and they're still really high as I record this I'm getting emotional I'm getting emotional God I'm so happy for you but why did you have to leave a few days before he left we both were being really good Samaritans and we went to AKU to go get our blood drawn one of his friends of a friend really desperately needed blood and since we both are pretty healthy, we both went to go donate blood. How are you feeling? Good. Woozy. Woozy. That was so lame. I think that's me done. I'm done. Now it's the week of him leaving and Bastuba had a lot of plans so she's going to tell you about those now. Good morning folks. It is a sad sad week in Dubalan today. My fiance is leaving for Australia on Friday. It's currently Tuesday and I am heading to the store for his goodbye cake one of his goodbye cakes. Tomorrow night we're throwing him a surprise going away party and that's going to be really fun. 
but he has no idea about it. He did plan his own goodbye dinner as Ozer coded as that is. He decided that he's going to plan it because he thought nobody was doing anything for him. I couldn't tell him that I was already planning something for Wednesday with the rest of his friends. So I'm currently heading to the store. I'm going to go look at some fruit to see what's in season. Um, he loves a fruit cake. He loves something light and fruity. Tomorrow I'm making him a tiramisu cake, but today I'll probably make him like a peach cobbler, peach crumble sort of situation. The next day. Tiramisu time! Ladyfingers, mascarpone cream, cocoa, coffee, sieve, spatula, big dish. That's so true, that's so true. <laughs> joking this man was actually 100% made for me because what do you mean that I tried to surprise him with like 10 to 15 of his closest friends and the first thing he saw when he came in were nuggets and he was so excited about them too he is my soulmate no joke he is made for me Anxious? <laughs> All the feelings. All the feelings. All the feelings. Yes. 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 <laughs> Just the tiniest little bit. Yes. The madam. The madam must The madam must The madam must kill him. The madam must The Everyone just left. It's like two in the morning. I am exhausted. Good night. The day before his flight, we, we had our final lunch together and he took me to Kafila, which is the most like marriage coded thing in the world. Lovely little gossip sesh about the party the night before. Lit Why do the berry bites have scores on them? Why are the lines in them? 
थैंक यू थैंक यू before literally just spent as much time as we could with each other took a couple of long drives went and got a coffee i didn't record a lot of it after kafila because i really wanted to like be present and be with him yeah that was basically it and then very quickly 23rd of august came around he was leaving at 10 in the morning he was going to call a kareem and go on his own but i almost beat him with my shoe because i was like there is no way in hell you're doing that when i know how to drive so let's go <laughs> It's 6 a.m. It's time. So I drove him and his family to the airport. We went. Uh, we had a couple of teary goodbyes, and then afterwards, I think his sister knew how badly I was going to take him leaving. So she was just like, "Should we go and get a coffee afterwards?" And it was like eight in the morning, and I had a long day of work ahead. So I was like, "Sure, why not?" Gave them my goodbyes, and I headed off. back to work as i'm speaking to you now it's the 30th of august my world did not end and as me and my therapist constantly talk about i feel like i have been at the cusp of change for a really long time but this month i really genuinely feel it but the amount of opportunities that are opening and all of these doors that are opening for me i am so excited i hope the video looks and sounds better than it did last month because i really am trying i feel very lucky I feel very grateful to be where I'm at right now and I hope that this feeling of happiness of hopefulness stays all the way through September but to see if that actually happens you're going to have to watch me next month I love you thank you for watching I'll see you in September doodles